ഹൈ പോക്കറ്റ് ഡി യു എസ് ഇന്ന് ഐ എഫ് എഫ് കെയുടെ മൂന്നാമത്തെ ദിവസമാണ് പകലത്തെ വൈബൊക്കെ നമ്മൾ നേരത്തെ കണ്ടറിഞ്ഞു ഐ എഫ് എഫ് കെ രാത്രി എങ്ങനെയാണെന്നുള്ളത് കാണണ്ടേ എന്തായാലും ഇപ്പോൾ ഇത് കാണാം പിന്നെ ഇന്നത്തെ ഹൈലൈറ്റ് എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞാൽ റിസൂൽ പൂക്കിറ്റൊക്കെ വരുന്നുണ്ട് എന്തൊക്കെയോ സംഭവങ്ങളുണ്ട് നമുക്കത് നേരിട്ട് കണ്ടറിയാമല്ലേ ലെറ്റ് ഗോ Right, uh, introduction to Heidi Bashara. Habibi, La Habibi. Um, see, my introduction to Mr. Khairi's work is uh, very recently I visited Egypt and I have been a part of uh, one of the you know, very upcoming Egyptian film festival called Eguna. And um, I was a jury there. Mr. Khairi was the um, jury chairman. So that's why I met him and I found uh, what an amazing, amazing soul and I invited him to India and I promised him that I will take him to um, Kerala. He loves Indian food so I promised him that I will get him best Indian food from Kerala. But you know, uh, like all film people, I am one of those unscrupulous guys who couldn't turn up here on time. and uh, i have to leave tomorrow because i'm uh, currently mixing a movie and i wouldn't be here for the best part of the festival uh, i apologize on behalf of all the malayalis i uh, i studied in the city i have a house here now and khairi um, uh, was very kind enough to take me to one of the best indian joint in egypt and you know fed me indian food and i told him like this is nothing if you come to india we we will give you indian food in egyptian cinema Uh, he is revered quite, quite like Satyajit Ray in the Egyptian cinema. And some of his best work has come out of his life uh, in Egypt. He went to them. All that and our forefathers of our constitution has, has, has foreseen something which uh, even after 70 years of India's independent history, we were not, not been able to sort of implement it and uplift uh, uh, you know, a certain... It's worth, the market is, it's worth. minority is people who is on markets yes yes and uh, mostly they are the majority <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah so coming back to um, um, your work you know india and egypt is very very similar in terms of uh, the popular music it holds uh, you know we are um, we are very very familiar with the uh, you know some of the algerian musicians like khalid and other people and lot of egyptian musicians and um, the way music is used in their mainstream film you know like the way we use uh, music in our mainstream cinema is, is exactly the same way egyptian have used uh, music in the cinema so how do you see the similarity between the two nations which have nothing in common but uh, there is they are connected with their music and cinema as i remember uh, when i was too young Uh, uh, Indian films like Sangam, uh, Suraj, uh, and before this film, uh, very famous, Mother? Yeah, um, Mother India. Mother India. Uh, so this film was very uh, uh, hits, and uh, in, uh, not in the first uh, uh, row of the cinemas, also go to many, many cities, small cities, very popular, uh, this Indian film. and of course uh, for example uh, i remember maybe the most was uh, mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, um, you know uh, in egypt when you walk around the road if they spot you an indian if they spot you they you know they have come to me and said on the budget i said no rasul bhuti sharukan when i showed him uh, uh, a photo of me and sharukan trust me this tourist guy didn't accept money from me To, to to show the whole of uh, pyramids around and all that so that's how that, that's kind of love they share which is connected with cinema so do you feel 
um, the mainstream cinema in Egypt is quite different from the, from the cinema that you practice? You see, um, Egyptian cinema, it's uh, the first, the first uh, projection of cinema at 8, uh, 1895, 1996 in uh, Grand Café uh, uh, through uh, Lumière Brothers in uh, Paris. Uh, Egypt uh, has the same near date for the first projection in Alexandria. And uh, uh, one of the uh, big fears in uh, France, uh, when they saw Egyptian cinema longer ago, maybe at 50s, 60s, and they saw a film called The Will. It's produced 39. And he discovered this film is proceeding Italianism and uh, Kamal Selim, this director, at 39, he, he make uh, something near, very close to Italian uh, neorealism after the Second War. Yeah. So, uh, of course, uh, like Indian cinema, most Egyptian films, uh, yeah, I mean, musical, hmm. uh, um, most comedian, and I think it's, it's, yeah, you can see the, the root of two cinemas, but of course the situation of Indian cinema now it's uh, far of Egyptian cinema. It's uh, now the good old uh, Egyptian cinema. Yeah, it's, far a, from. it's a big industry. Egypt cinema now go for decline. Okay, uh, you know that um, uh, in Egypt uh, there are huge stars, um, not just cinema stars, and uh, musicians, composers, and, and singers. They're very huge there, you know, unlike uh, in India where you, you have very little, uh, uh, you know, uh, musicians are stars. Uh, we have more film, you know, we associate uh, film stars with uh, the music uh, that they produce. Um, is that, uh, like, uh, is that something that helping the music industry versus the film industry? See, uh, quality also. Yeah. For example, uh, my son is uh, working in the United States. He's a, a, a professor in psychology. He and his wife is uh, Chilean. They love Shahrukh Khan. Yeah, they, uh, they, uh, <laughs> uh, and maybe first time I, I heard about Shahrukh Khan from him. You see, <laughs> and my wife, my wife is Polish. Also, so most of his in the United States. I, I'll tell Shahrukh this and I'll convey this to him. Um, <coughs> coming back to your work, uh, what do you think is the reason? See, the neorealism is like the post-Second World War. Neorealism uh, caught up in Italy and it's spread all over to the sea, to all the other countries. And uh, 50s and 60s of Indian cinema also saw that uh, huge change in the way films are looked at. But it, it took a quite a few more years to come into Egyptian cinema, like in the late 70s and 80s. Uh, I mean 80s, mostly 80s, because you started it. So what do you think is the reason so it got so delayed, like a movement that swept the world and world cinema? What do you think is the reason why it took so long to come to Egypt? Uh, because the, the industry itself, you see, film school in Egypt uh, established at 59, then the first uh, uh, New generation from film school finished at 63. The year when I uh, studied, I, I am the fifth generation of film school. Mm -hmm. and then uh, at the beginning, the newcomers who studied cinema because most of the uh, famous film director, of course, they didn't study cinema. Uh, they saw us uh, that we have like uh, aggression to the to in this industry. It took time then we have chance to uh, get our uh, place, you see. Uh, for me, when I started cinema, it's the same, uh, yeah, for example, if, if, when I hear Scorsese, because I finished the year before, it's the same, but yeah, we saw, when we studied cinema, Cesare, uh, Fellini, Visconti, Basolini, uh, Nobel Park, French uh, Nobel Park. Uh, we are 
Yes, you want to change cinema with a, a way against the commercial and against the star system. Our constitution has, has, has foreseen something which uh, even after 70 years of India's independent history, we have not, not been able to sort of implement it and uplift uh, uh, you know, a certain... It's worth the marginalists, it's worth the minority is people who are on marginalists. Yes. Yes. And uh, mostly they are the majority. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So coming back to um, um, your work, you know, India and Egypt is very, very similar in terms of uh, the popular music it holds. Uh, you know, we are um, we are very very familiar with uh, you know some of the Algerian musicians like Khalid and other people and a lot of Egyptian musicians. And um, the way music is used in their mainstream film, you know, like the way we use uh, music in our mainstream cinema is, is exactly the same way Egyptians have used uh, music in the cinema. So how do you see the similarity between the two nations, which have nothing in common, but uh, there is, they're connected with their music and cinema? As I remember uh, when I was too young, uh, uh, Indian films like Sangam, uh, Suraj, uh, and before this film, uh, very famous, Mother, uh, um, Mother India. Mother India. Uh, so this film was very uh, uh, hits, and uh, in, uh, not in the first uh, uh, row of the cinemas, also go to many, many cities, small cities, very popular, uh, this Indian commercial films. And of course, uh, for example, uh, I remember maybe the most was uh, Sanjay.